Hello everyone, Game Dog here. Welcome back to Logibox. Today we have version 1.3. And uh, today's update is actually one I'm actually quite a big fan of. So, okay. Sometimes when you make uh when you make um when you make a uh, your own Logibox puzzle. Uh, okay, that took a while to load. <laughs> Sometimes when you make a Logibox puzzle, occasionally you might make something that is actually impossible to do without multiple guesswork. Or is even, or even has the possibility to have many possible solutions. Well, this week they've added a little feature to tell you like just how fair your puzzle is, like how difficult it is, and it is this checkbox down here. So you click that, and this is actually really cool in my opinion. I love watching uh, computers do this. Basically, what it's doing is it's doing a quick run through of the giant puzzle I just made. Um, it's going through and it's calculating impossible or it's calculating exactly where um ah no solution okay so apparently i made an impossible logic box but it basically goes through the entire puzzle and just tells you um what can and cannot uh, work or uh, I, i'm not a logic box expert by the way i'm not exactly sure what it's doing i'm just kind of <laughs> i just think i mostly understand it like say you were to make something really simple right here if you clicked on it It'll, oh, it actually didn't get it right away. Multiple answers. Huh. That can happen as well, too. Sometimes you will make a um a puzzle that actually has multiple answers. Uh, let's see if we can give it something a little possible to do. Let's do something like uh like that. These rows and this row and column should fill in instantly. Yeah, see? Unless I can give me the exact same problem. I got a no solution problem that time. So, yeah, there you go. If you want to make puzzles but are a little concerned that they might be a little too difficult or even borderline impossible, this is an update for you. It's a, it's a really cool one, actually. Um, and as someone who's very, uh, who's very new to Logibox, this, um, this little game is probably my first big exposure to it. It's really, really nice to have a little button just to tell me if... Okay, I'm learning a lot about what kind of patterns you should not use when you play these sorts of games. <laughs> It's really convenient to have, um, yeah, there we go. It's really convenient to have, um, sort of like a little, uh, sort of like a little checker to see, uh, just how easy or hard your puzzle is. So, yeah, there we go. Um, I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.